So I'm not sure if you're familiar, but I like for my vehicles to make a little bit of noise. I don't like a quiet vehicle. So we are going to be taking off this massive exhaust system. I mean, look at this thing. You got a resonator right there. As, as well as that huge muffler that runs almost the length of the entire truck. Uh, unacceptable. Well, let's be completely honest. We not taking it off, but I'm going to get it done. But first, let me let you hear how this thing sounds with this exhaust system. I'm not exactly sure how that sounded, but this thing is quiet. So this is the exhaust we're gonna be putting on here, but let's get up here and see if they got time to fit me in. All right, so I just pulled up to Meineke. They're gonna go ahead and throw the exhaust on for me today. I'm gonna go have some lunch and some other stuff, and then we're gonna see how it sounds without that big massive exhaust system that's on there two hours later all right so the exhaust just got finished it is on there we're gonna go ahead and crank it up and see what it sounds like Many hours later. So the exhaust has been on for about a day now. I've seen a lot of videos prior to putting on my exhaust about the MBRP as far as if there's cabin drone and any noises that resonate throughout the cabin. And going at slower speeds, you definitely hear some drone. It's not unbearable or anything like that, but we're about to hop on the highway and see how it sounds on the highway all right so we are turning on to the highway right now so we're going to get up to speed and find out if we hear any droning inside the cabin so right now i'm right around 75 ish miles per hour and honestly the drone decreases it seems like the faster you go versus when i was going at lower speeds I could hear the cabin drone a little bit more. So if you had this exhaust on your car and you're gonna be doing like longer highway drives at around 60 to 80 miles per hour, I'm doing 80 miles per hour right now and I'm not really hearing anything in the cabin. If I had the music on, it'd be completely comfortable. So I'm giving the exhaust a thumbs up for right now. It does have an awkward sound. It takes some getting used to cause I'm used to a V8 and the Flowmaster's on my V8, the V8 puts out a deeper sound. This one's a little bit more throaty. It doesn't sound like a Honda fart can or anything like that, but it's definitely a sound that I gotta get used to. It, it kinda sounds a little bit like a truck, but it also kinda sounds like a tuner or a sports car. It's kind of a mix between those three. And if I can, I will try to get you some clips of the truck pulling away so you can hear it from the outside really quickly here at the end of the video let me get to where i gotta go and we will um check back in then All right, oh, seatbelt. All right, so there you have it. You got to hear what it sounds like pulling away. Let me know y'all thoughts. What do you think the exhaust sound like? Did I go with the right choice? I know this ain't no motorcycle content, but the next video will be. 
make sure you hit subscribe like and comment share the content if you were thinking about getting this exhaust let me know if this video helped you out but i will check y'all out in that next one deuces